Welcome to Hooked on Utah. Today we have a fantastic adventure. I know you've got up on Saturday mornings, you've watched them and said, hey, how can I be a pro bass fisherman? Well, today's adventure is on a local Lake Jordanelle. We're with one of the top pros from Utah who fishes the FLW Walmart series, the Strand series. We're gonna teach you how to be a pro bass fisherman in your own backyard. Stay with us. Hooked on Utah is proudly presented by Sportsman's Warehouse, America's premier outfitter. Prime Snacks, a delicious cut above. Interstate batteries, outrageously dependable. Hell's Canyon Custom Rods, featuring the Hooked on Utah series. Smith & Edwards, Utah's original adventure store since 1947. Edge Products, the engine performance leader. And Skeeter, featuring the all-new FX Bass Boat. Today's tournament on Jordanelle is what we call a fruit jar tournament. You only get to bring a couple of things, and what makes this unique is it's all top water. So we're going to head on into Sportsman's Warehouse, get a few top water baits for today's event, and then go see what we can make happen. I'm gonna stick it to the pro. Yeah! FLW Walmart's got nothing on me, baby. I've got <laughs> something that I'm gonna win. Mark a hash mark next to the number the number of you caught, and then we're gonna calculate by weight. Dude, anytime you get a chance to go fishing, man, it's awesome. Five fish, five biggest fish, 12 inch minimum size. This could be a you know a million dollar event. It's the same to me. You know, I'm just excited to go out and go fishing and have an opportunity to fish with Gary and, and uh, Let's go out and have a good time. If you want to start bass fishing, this is where you start. Club tournament like this up on Jordan L. Um, I think we're at about eight to 10 boats. Right now we're, we're going out to the wakeless buoys where we'll do a shotgun start. Raise your hand if you're in favor with 1030. Okay, 1030 it is. To fish with somebody who's been doing it for a living, um, it's where you learn a whole lot about fishing and you can quantum leap your own skill set by just watching what, what someone like Roy can do. So it should be a lot of fun, but don't be fooled. I'm gonna try to win. Big ones. Nice. That's our trophy? Yeah. Nice. Thanks, bro. He's cheating already, he's not wakeless. We're gonna DQ him. Look at that. That's uncalled for. We're gonna run up the river arm and uh, go to a few places Roy's got uh, scoped out and see if we can't uh, stick a couple big fish right off. You know, if we get lucky, we'll put a three to five pounder in the boat. There's some big smallmouth in this lake. And then, you know, if we get the bite going with the right conditions, it can be a lot of fun. This is a uh the Provo River Inlet area. Top water is what everybody likes to fish if, if the bite's going because you actually see the fish come up and attack that bait and there's an explosion at the surface. It's a lot of fun. And you know, and I don't know why, I just, it's just what I've always wanted to do. And like I was saying earlier, even these fun little tournaments are just a blast to me and just being able to come out and fish, you know? It's just such a blessing in my life to be able to do it. And, and uh, you know, I praise God every day that I'm able to do it. Yeah, back east they call these fruit fruit jar tournaments where uh, you know back east all the guys get together and they just put five ten twenty bucks in a in a jar and then whoever comes in with the best uh, limit of fish gets the you know the jar of money so they've been doing these little tiny tournaments back east for years and years and years and uh, so it's, it's a neat deal should be fun me and Gary I'm big pumped. ones I'm pumped right here is good anywhere right it's go here go time baby you need to get a boat and get out here.